Hello, YouTuber Shrinks Compatriots, Bootlicker Chills, Dead Slay, Surfs, Peasants, Vassals, Minions, Meat Sacks. I'm a useful idiot. Welcome. And uh, today I want to do a video on uh, arguably one of the worst mayors in the entire country. And uh, he's actually on a long list of some of the worst mayors in uh, U.S. history that are running a lot of American uh, metropolitan cities and uh, with disastrous policies. But uh, let me get right to it. I, I was thinking about uh, doing a whole video listing all the, the issues with uh, somebody like Brandon Johnson and his disastrous policies. One, of course, one of his disastrous policies is that instead of addressing the uh, problems of auto theft in Chicago, he, he decides he's going to sue the auto companies, uh, which is another just completely misguided policy, and he's not addressing the issues. Uh, a good example of that is okay, well, he goes after some of the cars that are easier to break into, and he sues the automakers, and then uh, the people that are breaking into cars and stealing cars are just going to move to other brands. But anyway, I, I don't want to get into that right now. I've decided not to do a long video on Brandon Johnson at this point. I may in the future. But let's talk about Brandon Johnson and this latest story that came out, because uh, Brandon Johnson is a pimp, and we know he's a pimp because he spent $30,000 on his own personal needs for hair and makeup and um, so he's totally pimping out and then he has the audacity to come out and say that he's uh, uh, giving business to underserved communities by spending thirty thousand dollars on uh, pimping out so uh, he's just the worst of the worst and he's a grifter because he used thirty thousand dollars out of campaign funds and uh, donor money and taxpayer money to pay for him to pimp out and then he's totally incompetent like I say uh, because his policy is disastrous he's been a disaster since he, he got in office and I just pray that uh, the, the voters wake up there and vote him out of office but of course they'll vote him out of office and get some other idiot in there because let's, let's remember Lori Lightfoot uh, was arguably the worst mayor in the entire United States and they voted for her and she, she, she just got replaced with this fool. And so that's how it goes. So Chicago's just going to keep going down the shitter because they keep electing people like this. But that's what you get when you have an uninformed uh, media brainwashed uh, public. And so, uh, but uh, one of the things I, I do want to talk about in this video is just the, the implications of a case like this. Because we see it over and over and over again. We see these grifters and pimps and incompetence. Uh, in the government, both on a federal level, a state level, a county level, and a city level. And all of them are grifters because what happens is uh, just like with congressmen and just like with presidents and, 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 and uh, attorney generals and whoever, uh, you get them in a position where they, they have access to money. So they're, they're not necessarily criminals by nature, but they're given the opportunity to be criminals. And uh, uh, Fannie Willis down in, in Georgia is a good example of that, uh, you know, she she obviously has all kinds of ill-begotten cash, you know, paying cash for these uh, vacations for her and her, her lover, who, who, who then she hires with an inflated salary to prosecute Trump in Georgia. And we see cases like this almost every week now of these people in these positions that end up uh, uh, padding their, their salaries and their lifestyle. And, and they always go for the luxury items. They always go for vacations. They always go for jewelry. Uh, they, they, they always go for uh, uh, expensive cars and, and uh, move into exclusive neighborhoods. And, and that's just how it goes. And we see that everywhere. So, to, so for me, that's the big picture. Uh, just the, the, the mediocrity of the leadership we have on the, on the federal level, on the state level, on the county level, on the city level. Just utter mediocrity. And then they treat uh, all the, the money from taxpayers and donors as some kind of slush fund so they can live like kings. And uh, it's just despicable and disgusting. And, it, and it's just a, a huge trend. So the fact that more people aren't outraged by this uh, says a lot about it, too. But uh, that, that's what I want to say about this. Brandon Johnson, he's a pimp, a grifter, and an incompetent. And that's the kind of leaders we have from top to bottom now. And you get them near money. They're going to steal it, and they're going to spend it on all the expensive shit they want. That's just how it goes. So there you have it. I'm a useful idiot. Don't you be one, too.